Want to take your gaming to the next level? Then you're definitely going to want to check out our Sennheiser review for the EPOS GSP 601 and 602. In addition to that, guys, we are going to be doing a giveaway for these headsets. So let's go ahead and find out if these get the laser bolt approval or if they don't. Let's dive into the review. Esseva, this is Laserbolt, and welcome to today's video, guys. Today, we're taking a look at the Sennheiser's EPOS GSP 601 and 602. There are two different headsets, but almost have all the identical features. The only big changes here are the colors, guys. We have one with a nice white finish, and we also have one with a nice blue finish. It's going to be a personal preference, which one you guys like the most, if you guys like the white or you like the blue. But I like the fact that they actually give us the option of picking two different colors. In addition to that, aesthetically, the headset looks amazing and it's very futuristic looking, very cyberpunky. We have that cyberpunk feel since, you know, that's what's in the vibe right now. And I like the fact that the headset actually looks very futuristic. It doesn't look like your ordinary headset that we've come accustomed to. I like the fact that they put a little bit of thought into the design and I'm kind of happy that they actually did. Now, for those of you who might not know, Sennheiser is one of the most leading companies and one of the best leading companies when it comes to audio. They're really good with microphones. They're really good with headsets. Their audio quality is amazing. And they're a, a German company, for those of you who don't know or haven't heard of them. They're mostly well known for their mics. Their mics are really, really good. But not too much for headsets. They entered the headset sphere just a couple of years ago. So we are going to be diving into these. So I'm really excited to tell you guys how good these are. So like I said, aesthetically, the, the headsets are very aesthetically pleasing. In addition to that, guys, overall design, and they feel very comfortable in your head. They're extremely light. They look a little bit heavy. Like, I mean, you know, when I first saw them, I thought they're going to be a little bit heavy, but they're very, very light. Now, if I could give you guys a perfect example of how light they are, they're very similar to the uh, A50s. If you own, uh, if you've ever owned Astros, they're the same uh, kind of like weight density when it comes to headset. They're extremely comfortable. And I like the fact that they've made multiple adjustments adjustable options for you guys to actually use your headset not only do they let you adjust the size of your headset like depending how side you know how much you want to fit in on your head but they also let you adjust the tension on the top of the headset to determine how much the headset actually sits on your head so whether you are a large individual a, whether you have a large head a small head it doesn't really matter it's going to fit perfectly because there are a lot of adjustable features that are going to let you you know put those together and decide where you guys want the ear cups are very soft and deep and one thing i do like about the actual ear cups themselves is that uh, as you guys know there's some headsets that sit on your ear right like the you, you put them on and they'll sit on your ear and those tend to cost a little bit of heat uh you know but the cool thing about this and that this one doesn't really sit on your ear they're so big that they actually cover your ear and this allows them to be very comfortable and not have too much of a heat problem which i actually like but overall in general these are really nice and comfortable a lot of adjust uh, adjustment features and aesthetically pleasing and ergonomically very well sound for a headset now let's talk about the features for the headsets and we're going to be starting with the design for a passive noise cancellation and this is what i was talking to you guys about the ear cubs actually fitting on your ear as a as a part from actually being on top of your what this allows them to do is that these headsets have a passive noise cancellation. Now, this is not like, you know, industry leading technology, but what it basically what it does, it'll drown out the noise that's in your room. So you can only hear the noise that's coming through your headsets. This is actually pretty good. And I actually feel that these headsets, it's one of like the key points on this headset. Like if you have a really loud room or you have a really loud environment and you want to be immersed in the game, then you definitely want to pick up these headsets because these actually do really good a noise cancellation that's actually one of the things i really enjoyed about these headsets now one thing that makes sennheiser stand out from the rest of the competition is their proprietary speaker system now this is a trademark op a portion of their system of their you know, speaker system that delivers competitive edge boosting acoustics performance now what that means in layman terms is that you'll be able to hear the quality of footsteps you'll be able to hear the quality of bombs you know the bass you'll be able to hear that really fine detailed uh, option when it comes to you know especially you're immersed in games whether you're playing first person shooters or rpgs now what makes this really interesting is that the new consoles like the ps5 and the new xbox these two consoles in particular are going to be coming in with a new audio technology and this is going to sound so perfect on these headsets even right now if you own a pc you probably already have the windows sonic or you have the uh, adobe atmos this is going to make it sound really nice and clean 
when you guys are using the headsets. One cool feature I also enjoyed about the headset, of course, as you guys, if you've been watching my reviews, when it comes to headsets, I always like when headsets have the mic and they have that mute up option. What I mean the mute up option is when you pull the mic down, it unmutes it. When you put the mic up, it mutes the mic, you know, it mutes the mic, which I think is a very innovative and very cool, uh, you know, immersive experience. So you don't have to be like, constantly seeing if you muted your mic or not. All you got to do is flip it up and it's muted. You flip it back down and it's unmuted. I thought that was actually pretty cool. Now we'll go a little bit into the mic and how that sounds in a little bit later. So if you guys are wondering about that, then uh, we're going to jump into that. So. Another cool thing about the headsets, I like the whole intuitive volume control. And the thing I like about this is that it's actually very discreet on the headset. It's not like a big dial button that you could see on the headset on the side of the headset. It actually looks like it was part of the headset. And if you see the headset, you probably wouldn't even know that that's actually the dial to rush the volume or to lower the volume. It's easily accessed. And one thing I wish that they would have added for this particular dial is I wish they would have added an option where you could probably hear a noise or you could probably hear a cue in your headset of when you completely mute it and a cue when you completely turn all the volume all the way up. I mean, if you're listening to Sennheiser, definitely go ahead and add that option. Now, one thing I did like about the headset after, you know, testing it out, because you guys know I usually take like about a week to a week and a half to actually test these headsets. These were actually sent to me by Sennheiser. They sent me both and we're going to be doing a giveaway for these headsets. I'll talk, I'll talk about the giveaway towards the end of the video. But the cool thing about these actual headsets is that they're actually built to last. So if you're planning to pick up a headset that's going to last you a long time, like maybe a year to two years to three years, then these are definitely something you want to consider. They're very durable, uh, very sturdy. They're not going to be breaking. You know, it's not like you're like cheap material. They're going to be lasting you for a very long time. And that's one thing that I really enjoyed when it comes to headsets. I want a headset to last. Now, I know you guys are probably wondering, Laser, does this actually work? For the next gen consoles, will this work for the current consoles? What consoles does this work? So this works with a PC. If you own a PC, or you guys should already know that. It comes with two cables. It comes with a 3.5 millimeter, uh, you know, jack. So you could definitely plug this into your iPad, you know, your tablet, your cell phone, your computer, anything that has a 3.5, you'll be able to plug that and listen to the audio. Now, if you want to hear the mic, you want to have the mic and the audio. It also comes with a different cable that's allowed to plug into the PC, the way you could plug your, you know, your your mic, and you could also plug in your your headset to get that output. So I like the fact that they actually added two different cables to give you that flexibility, whether you just want to take it on the road and to go, or you just want to be at home and uh, you know doing some streaming or anything like that. Now the headset does work for your consoles. It works on the Switch. It works on the PS4. It works on the Xbox. Of course, you're gonna have to be plugged in uh, in order for that to work because there's no like wireless connectivity. So now that we went over the features of the headsets, let's talk about what I liked, what I didn't like, and I'll give you my opinion if this does definitely get the laser bullet approval. And then we'll talk about the giveaway. So real quick, uh, things that I liked. I like the noise cancellation. I think by far is one of the best noise cancellations out of the majority of headsets that I've tried. Uh, I like the fact that the headset is very comfortable. It lets you sit and play for a long period of time. Uh, you know, usually like my gaming sessions are pretty, pretty long. I like the fact that they actually go over your ear as opposed to be on your ear. Allows the heat, uh, you know, this doesn't allow the heat to come in. And also one thing I did like is that they actually drown the noise. That's one thing I thought it was really intuitive of the way they did it. Because not only did they, you know, fix the whole heating problem. But they also fix the whole audio thing where you're not hearing if you're in a loud room people that are around you or keyboards or anything like that. Of course, you guys know I am a big component when it comes to flipping the mic up and down. So that's definitely a plus for me. Now let's talk about the things I wish would have been part of the headset. Now, as you guys know, if you guys have been watching the channel, one thing I enjoy about headsets is I like to take off my headsets and place it on my chest. Unfortunately, these do not have the swivel cups, which is something... I think every headset should have because as us as gamers, sometimes we need to just rest the headset or we need to take the headset off our heads and resting it on your chest is actually a pretty cool uh, aspect there. So I think that's something that I, I wish they would add it in the headset. One thing that I didn't like about the headset and I'm being perfectly honest and it's kind of surprising to me when I got these headsets and came to this conclusion, I did not like the mic quality on these headsets. Two things that I didn't like about the mic quality. Number one, it doesn't have noise cancellation for the mic. So the room where you're talking, it's going to pick up a lot of noise because it does not have noise cancellation. I wish it actually did have noise cancellation. And it, like I said, it's surprising to me because Sennheiser is one of the best you know, companies when it comes to making mics. 
and they put so much effort into the audio quality of the headsets and i i guess they kind of didn't put too much effort into the mic quality which is something that i i was a little bit bummed about because i was expecting these to actually be very good when it comes to when it came to you know, having a mic uh another thing i didn't like about the mic is that it doesn't sound as clean as other headset mics for example, your Turtle Beaches or your Astros, unfortunately, it does not have that same quality of fidelity because those two companies actually have noise cancellation. So I think that's the big key right there, which I wish they would have added it. So the overall in general, if you're looking for a headset that has amazing audio quality and you're going to be hearing fidelity up to the wazoo, then, then these are definitely your headsets. If you're looking for a headset that's going to help you multitask, for example, listen to the headset and you know use it as a mic for streaming, uh, these are not these type of headsets due to the fact that the mic quality is not there yet. Not saying it won't be able to get there, but I, 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 this time around, I wish their mic quality would have been a little bit better. Overall, in general, these do get the laser bolt approval when it comes to audio quality. Definitely by far, these are one of the best audio quality headsets you could use. Unfortunately, I wish the mic would be up there as well as the audio but it is not. Now let's talk about the giveaway, guys. We're going to be giving away these headsets live on stream. So, so if you guys want to make sure you guys get these headsets, head on over to my Twitch channel. Twitch link is down below. Make sure you subscribe. And we will have a live raffle on October the 4th. So if you guys want to make sure you enter and participate, make sure you guys head on over to the Twitch channel. Make sure you guys follow, follow us, subscribe. And enter to win one of these two pair of headsets. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the review. If you have any additional questions regarding the headsets, make sure you guys drop it down in the comment section down below. Thank you guys for watching, and I will catch you guys on the next video.